Wright, Maureen O'Hara, John Payne, and Natalie Wood starred in Miracle on 34th Street on Channel 7's Late Show. Stay tuned now for Feed My People here on Channel 7. Eyewitness News at Noon. It's news you can use. Daily Health Watch reports with Mary McCombs and Emmy Award winning medical expert Dr. Dean Adell. News you can use. Mary Travers Action 7 reports that will make you a smart shopper and protect your family. Eyewitness News at Noon with Ann Edwards, Clip Smith on Sports, Linda Pellegrino with AccuWeather, and Mr. Food. Eyewitness News at Noon. Oh, it's so good. Eyewitness News at Noon. News you can use. He's had dozens of top 40 hits and fans so devoted they follow him from concert to concert all around the country. On the next Oprah Winfrey Show, meet the guy who writes the songs. Barry Manilow, you'll hear him perform songs from his latest album. We'll talk about his life growing up in Brooklyn, to his first hit, Mandy and making it to a mansion in Bel Air. Meet singing star Barry Manilow on the next Oprah Winfrey Show. Watch Oprah Monday at 4 on Channel 7. Channel 7, Buffalo. Hello, I'm Edwin Newman. Every generation must deal with its own measure of crises and suffering. To those of us living in the 1980s, however, our world seems to be a virtual cauldron of turmoil. In the next 60 minutes, we're going to crisscross the world and move behind the headlines of war, hunger, and disaster. We will be focusing on the world's children, that part of humanity most often affected by the suffering of our times and most often forgotten. The World Vision Report. The Forgotten Children of the 80s. This is Alex Trebek in Dhaka, Bangladesh, with a report on the children who happen to live in one of the most poverty-stricken and disaster-prone countries in the entire world. I'm Meredith McRae. Here in Guatemala, I want you to meet two children who are caught between Central America's twin enemies, war and poverty. And I'm Sarah Purcell. Throughout the hour, I'll be talking with people right here at home, families just like your own, who are helping change our world one child at a time. And now your hosts, Sarah Purcell and Edwin Newman. Welcome. As we look into the faces of children during this hour, we will see two images. At first glance, the faces will reflect human suffering. A closer look will also show us innocence, curiosity, charm, even beauty. That beauty, that God-given potential in every child is the reason for this World Vision Report. During this hour, we'll have the opportunity of helping give life and hope to forgotten children. We'll be telling you more about it throughout.